All right, my name is Heather McKean. For any of you, oh, oh, thanks. <laughs> um, for any of you who don't know me, um, some of my videos are up on YouTube. And uh, I'm up here this morning, I'm gonna share just a little bit about my story. So uh, my Fast T journey began four years ago, really like this same week. And I was very, very sick. I had a lot of different diseases. And it was really about four years ago, this, um, you know, it was December, four years ago, um, that I found myself at home. I was on an IV drip. Uh, I had gone into liver and kidney failure. And I had been on, I had been diagnosed with Lyme disease and I had been diagnosed fibromyalgia, chronic fatigue. I had a condition called POTS, which was um, a heart condition. I was on medication. I had rheumatoid arthritis. I was taking injections. And at this point in my life, and I had many, many, many other diagnoses, I had been on, um, I was on 180 different uh, medications or injections or, uh, you know, uh, homeopathic drops and everything a day. And I mean, it would take me hours a day just to do my regime of pills. And so it, to me, I think no wonder I was in liver and kidney failure by this time, you know, in December. You know, your body's not meant to handle all of that stuff. And so uh, a doctor, I, I was unable to leave my house because I had some stuff going on with my back. And um, a doctor came to my house to, to, work, to work on me. And he said, you know, he'd known so much about my journey. And he said, have you ever heard of tapping? And <clears throat> up until that point, I had not heard of tapping. And I said, no. And he explained a little bit about it to me and talked about energy and stuff. And I was like, whatever, I'll look it up. I'm, I'll do anything. So I, I looked up tapping and that led me to EFT. And so I looked up EFT and it was talking about how, you know, all of this stuff was energy trapped from trauma in my body. And trauma that had happened and it was trapped energy and that all you had to do is like, you know, tap around on your head and face and body and stuff and think about every traumatic event that ever happened to you and that this stuff would go away. And I thought, oh my gosh, if I have to tap around my face on every traumatic thing that's ever happened to me, like I'm gonna still die sick. This is gonna take forever. And so I simply typed in the words faster EFT and I got taken to YouTube. And lo and behold, watched half of a video about a woman being tapped on in a chair, very similar to this one, um, about her back pain. And I, I didn't even make it through the whole video. And I was like, okay, I, this is amazing. I'm totally willing to try this. So I did some calling around. I called a practitioner and she said, you know, I'd be happy to work with you, but I'm going to Oklahoma City this coming week for a training. And so I was like, oh, okay. And then I thought, well, can I come to that training? Because, you know, I was like, I'm sure no one's ever seen anyone as sick as I, ha I am. You know, I figured I, I would, I had no anticipation of becoming a practitioner. I thought I would need to go and spend the entire week there to, to even be healed in, at, at, to any degree. So I sent Robert a message on Facebook thinking no way would he ever respond to me. And it was literally within an hour he responded back. And I was like, can I come to the training? And he's like, sure, come to the training. Now, this is a weekend that we're going to be talking about money. Now, if anyone has had any experience with chronic illness, uh, it doesn't pay well. <laughs> and I had been on disability and had spent that year in particular uh, about $30,000 out of pocket above and beyond my insurance. Uh, my husband and I didn't have jobs where we made a lot of money and I had been on disability for a while. So we were in a, an, a, a lot of debt at this point, medical bills and everything. And so flying to Oklahoma City within a week's notice to pay for a seminar and a hotel room and meals uh, when I could barely get out of bed didn't seem to make a lot of sense financially. Also for the fact that I had seen countless doctors, specialists, over the years and I'd spent just hundreds of thousands of dollars. So to sit and have to tell my husband, mm, yeah, I need another couple thousand dollars to go and have some guy from Oklahoma bang on my face. Pretty sure this is gonna heal me. 
you know, <laughs> like my husband's a saint because he's like, whatever, you know. So whipped out the credit card, hoping beyond hope, put everything on the credit card and landed here in Oklahoma City. On the first day, sitting just like you guys are sitting here four years ago, and Robert asked for a volunteer, and I got up in this chair, and I really didn't think anything was gonna happen. And my entire life changed. Mm. Now, it didn't all happen in 40 minutes, <laughs> contrary to much popular belief out there. But Robert shifted something in me. And, on, and I have to tell you, it happened first before I got in the chair. Because he explained things to me and everything started to make sense. And I realized, oh my gosh, I've been doing this to myself. And that was a big deal for me. And once I got up in the chair and, and I had already shifted so much in my mind and it just kind of went away like that. And that was four years ago. I am a full-time Fast JFT practitioner I live in Maui, on the island of Maui, and um, I'm living the life of my dreams. And this was just four short years ago. I've also, in the meantime, traveled and lived in South Africa, doing mission work in South Africa. I mean, my children have their mother back, my husband has his wife back, and I've been able to do so many things. I have helped so many other people come to the same life and change that I have myself come to. And so, as we're going to be talking about a lot of things over the weekend, and if you're staying for the week, just open your mind. Be ready to be changed. Whether you get in the chair or not, you are going to be experiencing life-changing moments over these next few days. And so, without further ado, I want to introduce the man that helped me change my life and is going to undoubtedly never be able to get out of your brain again. The amazing and wonderful Robert Smith. <laughs> 